कल पीठी दल पीठी इज अ डिश फ्रॉम बिहारी कुजीन इट इज अ फ्रेश पास्ता कुकड इन लेग्यूम्स दाल मीन्स लेग्यूम्स एंड पिट्ठी मीन्स डम्पलिंग्स दीज डम्पलिंग डेलीकेसीज आर ईटन अक्रॉस द रीजन ऑफ बिहार झारखंड एंड छत्तीसगढ़ Typically dal pitti is served with chokha which is mashed potatoes fried with some onions green chilies and pickle masala this combo is the best comfort food to put together so to prepare the dal i have taken yellow lentil or tur dal and red lentil or masoor dal wash and pressure cook the dal with turmeric powder salt and water if you don't know how to make dal then click the top link make sure the dal should not be overcooked or mushy so the dal is ready now take a vessel and add the dal so if you are preparing the dal in a pressure cooker then you can use the same pressure cooker for cooking this recipe since i have already prepared the dal first so i am just putting this dal into a new vessel now add water and let it boil so let's prepare the pitti now i have already prepared the wheat flour dough if you don't know that how to prepare a dough then please click the top link so take some small portions of the dough and then roll it like a roti now with the help of a cookie cutter cut it in a circle take out the extras now join the two ends together and the other ends together just like this so let's prepare another one I will show you three shapes today so carefully watch this I have mentioned all the quantities of the ingredients on the description box. So the dumplings or pitties are ready now. Now dal is already boiling so add the dumplings one by one into the dal and let it cook until the dumplings are soft and tender about 15 to 20 minutes It looks like dal pitti is ready to serve. Serve this Indian pasta hot with chokha, Indian pickle and ghee on top or clarified butter. I hope 
you have liked today's recipe share your thoughts and comments with me and don't forget to subscribe this channel one more thing beauty's kitchen is also available on instagram and facebook please follow beauty's kitchen over there for more updates and food history see you next time